Hey guys, this is Giridhar here. So today I'm going to show you how to uh, root your OnePlus One, and uh, possibly we will get to install the uh, Oxygen OS also at the end of this uh, video. Uh, it's also the same process which you can follow to install any custom ROM. Uh, I use the Bacon Root Toolkit uh, for uh, unlocking the boot bo bootloader and also the rooting my device. So I'll give a link uh, in my blog. For the uh, for downloading the bacon root toolkit, it's it's very simple. Uh, you don't have to worry too much about uh, all the uh, uh, our drivers and other softwares and other applications that you need to download. Just uh, it's a one one uh, one stop solution for uh, rooting your uh, um, OnePlus. So I have everything in place now. So I'm gonna start the process of uh, rooting, unlocking the bootloader is gonna wipe out all the data in your uh, system so make sure you make a proper backup I've clicked on the link it says unlock and it also warns you that this will wipe your device so I made a backup already using the same backend rootkit toolkit and uh, right now yeah my device has been directed it is gonna reboot my device into bootloader mode let me show you exactly what's happening here in the mobile. My bootloader has been unlocked. Now it's uh, finishing up the booting process. Now everything has been wiped out of the system. It's as uh, good as a factory uh, reset. So all my data has been erased. So make sure you have a backup of all your data. Now all I have to do is, I have to go to this settings and enable the developer option. So just hit on the build in number a couple of times. Yeah, and uh, I have developer options enabled. And once I go to developer options, I have to enable Android debugging. So I'm, gonna, I'm also gonna check flash the custom recovery for me so it's going to flash the root file just some customary warning so we now have access to the uh, TWRP that's been pushed into it and uh, the system has also been rooted now so I'll go and show you. So we have this Super ACU application that is installed here. Now let's install the Oxygen OS. The procedure is same for uh, any other uh, custom ROM which you want to load onto your OnePlus One. While the phone is booting, just press the volume down button, and that will open up the custom recovery we just flashed it's called the TWRP or the team win recovery project so what we're going to do is install uh, ROM which we just uh, the oxygen OS which I just pushed onto the uh, root folder now if you already have another ROM and you want to take a backup of it I would recommend just say take a backup so this is the custom ROM that came in from uh, one plus one so I'm gonna take a backup of it okay so now we have the backup ready and uh, I'm gonna do a wipe here so do a wipe and now we don't have any ROM in the system it's all been wiped out and I'm gonna say install and I'm gonna select the one which says oxygen 1.0 flashable.zip and it's gonna be flashed now so it took a while but finally uh, it's done so it says successful here I'm gonna reboot the system oh sorry okay it just installed the super user also for me so this is the boot animation from oxygen OS so we have the oxygen OS right now so it asks for the one plus one setup right now so i'm and the first thing which is asked is like do you want to use the navigation control or the software uh, buttons so i prefer the navigation control at below so 
I'm not a big fan of the on-screen button there. So I'm going to leave it as it is. And there are a bunch of gestures. Double tap to wake, open camera, uh, and a few other gestures. I'm going to stay with those gestures. And it says, setup is complete. And there you go. The one plus one. The with the oxygen OS. Things first, let's check the, check the Android version. Okay, go to the about phone and it says 5.0.2. It comes with the basic applications which come with any Nexus device or any device that's got the uh, stock Android there. So, oxygen is equivalent to stock. So, is there any other? Yeah, this one feature was being talked about. So, they can enable or disable. Uh, the icons in the quick settings button there so i'm not going to use these stuff so i'm going to disable those from my view okay and there i have okay so that's my notification window there and that's it so your plain vanilla android experience is well it's, that's what the oxygen OS gives you so thanks for watching this video and if you have any doubts or any queries uh, regarding flashing your device with any custom ROM, do let me know and I'll be more than happy to help. Thank you.